In the heart of the capital Bandar Seri Begawan, Brunei Darussalam's iconic landmark, the Omar Ali Saifuddin Mosque, has been one of the top attractions of the country. The mosque was built in 1958 and is named after the 28th Sultan of Brunei, the late Sultan Omar Ali Saifuddin, who is referred as the architect of modern Brunei. The mosque serves as a symbol of the Islamic faith in Brunei and dominates the skyline of Bandar Seri Begawan. The mosque unites Mughal architecture and Malay styles designed by the architect and sculptor Rudolf Fanoli. Nodi used an early design prepared by the late Sultan Omar Ali Saifuddin, drawn with the assistance of the draftsman at public works department at the time named Awang Basar Sagam. The most recognized feature of the mosque is its main dome covered in pure gold. The mosque stands 52 meter high and can be seen from virtually anywhere in Bandar Seri Begawan. Linked to the mosque and built in the middle of a lagoon is a replica of a 16th century royal barge known as Bahtra. Even though the mosque was officially opened by His Late Majesty on the 28th September 1958, the lagoon beside the mosque was built much later and was completed in 1967 which cost a quarter million dollars. The lagoon was used to stage awkward and reading competitions. It was built to commemorate the 1400th anniversary of Nuzul al-Qur'an. The mosque interior itself was filled with elements of Islamic art, especially the calligraphy, flowers, and geometric design. The mosque can occupy about 3,000 worshippers. The mosque used many of the world's most elegant materials, including granite from Shanghai, marble from Italy, stained glass, and chandeliers from England. Amid the all aspiring architecture of Swas Mosque, the growing numbers of beautiful and mesmerizing mosques cannot be denied. The detailed architectural designs may still emphasize the symbol of Islamic faith in Brunei. Karena dari dulu saya berkeinginan ingin pergi ke Brunei karena ingin mengunjungi Masjid Umar Ali. Waktu saya di Indonesia, saya melihat dari kalender seperti ini kalender itu melihat itu Masjid Umar Ali yang masjidnya terbuat dari emas kubahnya asli. Murni gitu, murni. Jadi saya tuh penasaran kok oh, seperti apa semacam ini. So I've been traveling in a few Muslim countries and uh, I've seen a lot of mosques. Um, but what's particularly beautiful about this one is that it combines this, uh, this lavish gold with a very solemn and uh, clean color. It's uh, it's very calm and uh, beautiful without uh, too much um, extravagance. So it's really a special mosque. Good. I mean, color-wise, it's all brilliant, right? And the architecture is really splendid as well. Like the size and the history when it was built, like it was built in '58, and the material used, like the glass work, the mosaic, the stone used, like they have some marble inside, and peaceful and just the architecture. Everything is good. Alhamdulillah, ya senang gitu, senang gembira. Maksudnya apa yang keinginan dulu itu bisa tercapai di sini. Despite the growing numbers of mosques in the country, Sawas Mosque remains as a top chosen iconic landmark by tourists, for it is a great example of a modern Islamic architecture.